Every spot is available, boys. Every spot. Nothing guaranteed this year. There's been a lot of changes, and there's going to be a lot more changes before this camp's over, boys. Coming off their first losing season since 1999, the Buffalo Bandits began training camp with a few more questions and perhaps a little more anxiety than in recent years. A thought validated by some veteran players who have starred in this league. You talk about rookie, rookies being nervous, but you know, same thing. 16 years in, it doesn't doesn't change, and you're, uh, you know, you have the same old jitters like uh, you are when you're 19, 20 years old, and. Uh, just uh, definitely getting ready to roll here. It's definitely different coming into camp this year. I think the feel is different. Um, when you have people that are hungry and people that are, again, a little bit more youthful and, and younger and, you know, they're, they're maybe looking ahead, um, it, it's going to be a very interesting camp. It's going to be a very interesting year. I'm hoping they're looking at me for the next, uh, next one for, like, franchise player and whatnot because I'm hoping to stay in the long run for 15 years or whatever they want me to do. We have no preconceived notions as to any of the guys that we brought in are going to make it, how many of the older guys are still going to be here. I don't know. I do know that we have probably the best leader um, that I've ever been around in John Tavares. Just having him alone, I think, will be the glue that, that brings everything else together. I don't know if we're changing the nucleus, but we're just trying to change the culture a little bit. And around the league, I think there's been a lot of change towards the youth movement, and they've been successful with it. So I think it's easy for people to say, well, we got to do the same thing. This guy's getting old. This guy's getting old. I'm 44. I am old. And I just think people got to stop looking at people's their age and just kind of look at their performance. So how does one define this upcoming bandit season? Dominance. It, the, the, that, that word doesn't change. It's dominance on the floor, off the floor, uh, what we, how we carry ourselves. It, it has, we have to be dominant. And uh, we, need, we need teams to be afraid of us again. Um, I think last year we, we, we stumbled quite a bit, and uh, even me coming late, it, even within that short time, I think we were trying to find our identity, and we need to find that swagger, that dominance back, and uh, be the bandits that, that everybody's afraid of. With parity the prevailing word in pro sports, long-term dominance is rarely attained these days. But with such an intriguing mix of veterans and youngsters, this Buffalo Bandits group will uh, undoubtedly settle for short-term success, say, of the 19-game variety, before ever considering comparisons to a dynasty that started in this town more than 20 years ago.